is Jackie Wells. I'm a new student here at Ursuline, as well as a freshman, or as many of the girls call it here, a fresh woman. <laughs> I would like to start off today by telling you a little bit about myself. I attended my previous school for 10 years. Now, to some people, that may not seem like a very long time, but to a 15-year-old girl, that honestly feels like forever. My old school was really small, so I was with the same classmates, in the same building, and most importantly, in the same uniform for 10 years. Based on this information, I bet you're all thinking, wow, that must have been torture. Actually, I loved it because I'm the type of person who really doesn't like change. So last year, when November rolled around the corner, everybody started to apply and explore high schools. I was busy preparing for the HSPT, and it wasn't until my parents practically dragged me out of the house that I started going to some open houses. I did not want to leave my old school and go to a new school on top of having to go on a search to find the right one. On that note, I consider myself to be somewhat of a quiet and shy person. So you can just imagine how much fun I'm having up here right now. <laughs> Sometimes I find it even harder to talk to people that I really don't know. So while attending these open houses, I'm fairly certain I didn't say a single word to anyone. My mom did most of the talking for me, and I didn't really engage with the tour guides or any of the students. It wasn't until I came to the Ursuline open house that I actually communicated with another human being besides my mom. So we were waiting in line to be taken into one of the rooms, and my mom was talking with our tour guide. This girl approached us and started having this casual conversation with me. She just came up and started talking as though we'd been friends for years. I felt comfortable talking to her, and I got a glimpse of what the Earthline community is really all about. This girl was so genuine and personable, which is something I think every student at Earthline carries with them. Everyone has such a positive vibe that just makes you feel welcome. So, I bet you're all wondering, what did this girl say to me? The first thing she said was, my hair is a wreck right now. <laughs> then I said, I actually really like your headband. She said thank you and told me she liked my hair. Then she touched it and was so surprised, which is honestly a normal reaction for most people. <laughs> so we talked about how tightly curled my hair was for about two minutes and what hair conditioner we both used. The way she approached and treated me is something that I won't forget. This casual conversation is one of the things that draws me to Ursuline. Catherine was able to read me and my body language, allowing me to open up and feel comfortable having a genuine discussion with her about hair products. <laughs> At her most recent open house, I was able to be a tour guide. So I was waiting in line to lead a tour, and I saw an Ursuline girl with a really cool headband, which reminded me of my tour at Ursuline from the year before. I wasn't exactly sure if this was the right Catherine I was thinking of, so I asked her if she remembered talking to me at the open house last year. She said she did, and I told her she was one of the reasons that I decided to come to Ursuline. She gave me a big hug, and now we're becoming even closer friends. Catherine was able to read me in my body language, allowing me to open up and feel comfortable having a genuine discussion with her about hair products. One of the, as a new student, I'm able to experience Ursuline from a fresh and new perspective. I learned something new about the habits and traditions of these young women every single day. One of my favorite memories so far has to be Halloween. Let me tell you, everyone goes all out. I came as Chad from High School Musical. I had my hair down, had a Wildcats jersey on, and I even carried on a little basketball with me all day long. I thought I looked pretty legit. And I guess a lot of other people did too. I walk into the library and three seniors who I had never spoken to told me that they liked my costume. I walk into the hallway and a group of girls start singing, we're all in this together, and told me that like, they liked my costume. My favorite part of the day had to be when I went to lunch and a group of girls asked me to pose for a picture. I truly felt like Chad that day. <laughs> All the girls here are extremely approachable and generally want to get to know you. Doing something as simple as complimenting someone's Halloween costume goes a long way and is an everyday occurrence that brings students closer together. One of the most important aspects that I look for in a school is community. Coming from such a small school, our community was tight and welcoming. Everyone knew each other's name in the hallway, and you could talk to anyone at any time about anything. I found this feeling here at Ursuline. All the girls are genuine and want to get to know you and want to have each other's backs. There are so many different opportunities to socialize with upper and lower classmen, which brings the school together as a whole. 
I found a home here in this school, and I'm proud to wear my green plaid skirt to school every single day. I chose to attend Ursuline Academy because of the students and faculty who allowed me to be myself and accepted me into their community from the moment I walked in. I have grown to love it here at UA because I get an amazing and challenging educational experience as well as a bunch of new sisters I get to share it with. Thank you. Thank you.